Hi, this is Tony. Uh, I'm going to start by adding a file first and I'll show you what I mean. Um, let's try and get a good video file. I've got some video files. Uh, where's the video files? Back up, sorry. Keep moving them. There, there's the video files. Let's pick up something. Uh, let's say that one. Well, let's just put that on. It's just that's pretty fast, right? So what you do, you click on it, and then um, change. You can click on that and change the speed, right? So making it slower, right? So obviously that's already done. Now click on that it's going much slower right now put your effect on after so where's your effect there so you want to have um now wait a minute was it you want the artistic one or something or want some light leaks flying objects maybe flying object put the flying object on there now right so when you do it with slow it's already coming on slowly the same as the stuff right you could do that way that seems to work okay right or the other way would be uh, the way you've done it before so if we we undo that and undo that and undo that and undo that right back to the normal right so you put all your stuff on the music and everything if you do if you don't it one at a time like I just showed you it should work as long as you keep when it whatever you click on you can it comes up with the properties you change the properties per item whether it's um, that then you get to music where it's supposed to find the music um, I don't know it's up there I keep forgetting where I am music right so we add a music a piece of music to it right so click on the music change the speed there you'd have to change each one to exactly the same for each thing right we have to double click on it double click on each icon of whatever it is and you'll get the clip properties up there so you change each one to the speed that you want per item that's the way you could do it or the other way which I showed you just okay